in the key Heartland Athletic Conference Division II matchup on Friday evening at Susquehanna University. Kyle Datris of Loyal Sock was a one-man scoring machine. Datris rushed for three touchdowns. He threw for another and returned an interception for a touchdown as Loyal Sock defeated Lewisburg 34-7 as both teams are now 6-3. and three. Datris would throw for 85 yards on the night and he rushed for 132 yards. And here, he shows his ability to escape a would-be sack and complete a passing play down the near sideline. Lewisburg's only scoring of the night came in the second quarter when Logan Ike caught this 10-yard pass from Nick Castellioga and took it in for the touchdown. The other highlight of the evening for the Green Dragons was this nice interception by Dante Taylor. You know, I, I don't think we were very disciplined on defense to start. Um, you know, I thought we were flat defensively and offensively. Uh, made some errors on special teams, and um, you know, we just didn't play well. Play it by our best tonight. Kyle's a very special athlete. He's been running the triple option since he was a real young kid. And this year we decided to employ an awful lot of it. Uh, and and it, as the season wears on, we're planning to continue to use more and more. Uh, so the major major thing is to continue having him rep through it, continue having him go through his progressions, uh, and continue allowing him to become uh, more fine-tuned with what he's doing. We really put things together up front with our linemen, and they block great for us, and also I had simple reads to make, and I made them, and, you know, uh, Robbie Newton and our tailbacks, they made plays when I couldn't, so it all paid off. Some future Lewisburg High School cheerleaders showing off their skills on Friday evening at Susquehanna University. Elsewhere around the valley on Friday evening, Danville takes home the Judy Price Trophy and avenges last year's 14-12 loss as they improved to 8-1 with a 31-21 win over Bloomsburg. Montoursville goes to 9-0 with a come-from-behind 35-31 win over Mifflinburg. Montoursville getting the winning score with 51 seconds left in regulation. Jersey Shore rallied past Milton in a shootout 42-39. That's the third win of the year for the Bulldogs. Dominic Farinato had a 90-yard interception return for a touchdown for Mount Carmel as the Red Tornadoes get their sixth win of the year. They hold off a fourth-quarter rally against Sewins Grove for a final of 24-19. Southern Columbia joins Montoursville as one of the area's only 9-0 teams. They roll past Central Columbia 44-12. Alex Bruner rushed for 109 yards on six carries and had a touchdown. As Shikalimi rebounded from last week's loss at Danville with a shutout of Shimokin, 28 to nothing. While losing got by Warrior Run 55-13. And Mack Nye had 273 yards on the ground. He rushed for three touchdowns as Upper Dolphin ran its winning streak to four straight with a 27-0 win over Lion Mountain in Tri-Valley League action. It was the second week in a row the Eagles have been shut out. Elsewhere in the TVL, it was Millersburg 41 and East Juniata 6, Juniata 51, and Halifax 19. At Susquehanna University in Sewins Grove, Sean Wood for the dailyitem.com.